Hello, by watching this video. My name is Russell and welcome back to the murder of Sonic the Hedgehog. Where in the last episode, we are about to go ahead and start up our interrogations and stuff like that. Why did you come over here? There's nothing that I help either of you with. I ask that you leave me be. That stare, so cold. You know, maybe uh, we will get out here eventually. Zero, we certainly will not uh, start interrogation. We are about to go ahead and do all that kind of stuff because that's what they want. The more they want told us to do at the last end of the last episode, pretty sure. Shadow, we have some questions for you. Will you get, um, will you three get out? I'm busy. As I said, I have an appointment to attend to. Sorry, but this is important. Shadow, we've questioned everyone on this train, and every single person has mentioned running into you. Um, you've been locking every door in the train, and... And I know why! Why is that, Amy? Pray tell, why was I locking all the doors? <laughs> time to reveal my hot tip. I hope everyone's ready for a scoop, uh, um, for a scoop found by truly yours. We're ready. According to the map, the next car is the connector car where Sonic was stationed. Uh, this door right th uh, here in the lounge car is the only door that leads to the conductor's car following. So Shadow is locking all the doors for one reason and one reason alone. Thank you, Sonic, for mistaking the conductor's car. Um. So you think Shadow was trapping Sonic? I sure do. He locked the conductor's car, then locked all the other ones and um. All the others, so one locked door wasn't suspicious. Pure, pure conjecture. Um, you all get out of here and leave me be. Well, my source can back me up with these games. They will remain anonymous, but I think the point stands. My source claims they never saw Sonic again after he went into the conductor's car. Why? Because he was trapped and he couldn't leave the conductor's car. Uh, right this speculation. Okay, is this logic sound though? Was Shadow, was Shadow trapping Sonic? I'll play along and follow this train of logic, Amy. Shadow did lock all the doors to the conductor's car, prison Sonic. Then how was Sonic found in the dining car? Exactly! I think Zero uh, and I can explain the car change, however. Hmm? Zero, what events do we have to show that Sonic could have gotten to the dining car? Uh, the hidden door. The hidden passage. Okay, uh, just get my thoughts in order. Let's go ahead and do a little bit of that then, please. Thank you. Oh god, forgot. That's a minigame. That's kind of rough. Okay, um, can I not die, please? That'll be wonderful. Hopefully, that'll work out. I'm shocked nothing's, like, come at me yet. That's great. That's lovely. I so appreciate that. I don't feel like dying right now. Okay, great. Lovely. Grabbed all those. Grabbed all those. Okay. Um, let's grab those. Come on. Come on. Come on, please. Please get all these things. Okay, thank you very much. Let's grab all those. Okay, beautiful. Now, let's go ahead and see what's going on there. So how can I find a hidden passage in the wardrobe that leads right to the library car? What? A secret passage? So someone could have used the passage and snuck through the library car, walked past and directed um, the boys playing arcade, and safely arrived at the dining car. Excellent work, Grug. Hmm, this adjusts my theory a bit. Uh, so Shadow murdered Sonic in the conductor car, but then thought the crime scene being so close to the station, he was suspicious. So I picked up Sonic, locked the door to the conductor car, on the way out, he dropped the body off in the dining car. Are you officially accusing Shadow of murder? I am, but of course, this is just a theory. Uh, I don't have any evidence to back this up, other than my hot scoop. Ha, huh, seems Tails and I were more thorough than you. If Shadow's not going to talk, then I'll humor you once again. If Shadow traveled through the hidden passages and appeared in the library car, then how did Espio and Victor not see him? Well, um, I suppose it'd be hard to sneak around two people. Zero, do you have any guesses? Oh, well, Espio and Vector didn't see Shadow because Vector was his knuckles and Espio was reading. Uh, Espio was reading. I believe Espio was behind the bookshelf at the time of the reading. Espio reading in the library checks out, but we'll, um, that's not... That's what he told me. He's lying. What was that shadow? Um, when I completely obliterated Knuckles and Vector, whatever game, I left the soon car. I spent some time looking at uh, for Espio, but he was not there. He was not in the library car. I like to believe you. You're currently my okay. Why were you even searching for Espio, huh? If you must know, I needed to give him a key. As if. Why would a locksmith be giving away his keys? Shadow's been giving away a lot of keys, actually. Everyone but us seems to have one. That's true. Everyone's been able to unlock the next door for us. I didn't know that. Shadow's been passing out keys. Perhaps Zirok and I can further validate Shadow's claims. We can do what? Zirok, uh, what evidence supports Shadow's claim that keys giving away? This one. That feels good. Now just give my thoughts in order. Great. Do that again. We do that a lot, as of late, it seems like. Okay, more rings. Oh my god. I feel like I'm moving quick, and I'm worried about... You know, dying so many times right now. Okay, grab a couple of those. Grab a couple of those. Thank you for not making it too difficult on me right now. I appreciate it. I'm not smart enough in this game to go ahead and, like, make this difficult. Oh, God. That's actually getting really tough now. Okay, thank you. Please be simpler again. Or not. Or just not. I see a whole bunch of lights. And you just dead focus on the rings. Thank you. All right, 69. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Um, okay. There's only one reason that there actually exactly two ring keys on that key ring. Those were two, the two keys Shadow meant to give Espio and Vector. No way! Well, what, 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 what kind of key? Um, what of his own key? Couldn't, uh, one of those be for him? 
I have my own key on me. Shh, interesting. Uh, so let's say Shadow's telling the truth. Then what? If Shadow didn't murder Sonic and bring him to the dining car, then what possible reason would it have for locking all the doors? She's right. Her theory is strong. Tails and I certainly haven't presented any possibilities. Shadow, really instant? Uh, I think uh, Z Rock and I just know exactly why. Uh, why does he keep including me in this too? First, Amy, I just have a question for you. Has everyone today given you a birthday present? Oh, most everyone. Yeah, everyone's been so sweet. Sh I just, um, Shadow and Sonic haven't given me anything yet, but that's okay. Just bring them here is enough. Understood. Thank you, Amy. Z Rock? Uh, yes, Tails? I have a theory, but I need a piece of evidence to support it. We know Shadow walked through every train car locking the exits, and he gave everyone station the cars for a key, except for you, me, and Amy. That's right. The conductor gave Amy her birthday key, not Shadow. So why do you lock all the doors and not give us a key? Shadow couldn't find us. Shadow wanted to keep us away. Was Shadow locking all the doors to keep us away? Not us, Zero. I'm making a leap here, but stick with me. I think Shadow's trying to keep Amy away. What? Excuse me? Shadow would never do that. It's my birthday. You know it's my birthday, right? Don't you, Shadow? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Ah, uh, how dare- Xerox, show me the evidence. Huh? huh? Sh uh, if Shadow is trying to keep me away, prove it. You've been so thorough and whatever. What proof do you have? Uh, okay. Tails, um, thinks Shadow is trying to get keep Amy away. Why? What evidence? Uh, the crumpled up paper. Finally! That feels right. Phew. I just had to organize my thoughts. Again? How many of these mini games do I have to do? How many? 65 this time? Oh my god. Come on. You cannot be doing this to me. Game. Oh lord. Okay, come on. Let's play the best little Sonic Dash thing that I've played in my entire life. Get as many as I can uh, there. Those. Ew, okay. Okay. How much leeway are you going to give me here? Probably not much. Judging by all the stuff falling off the ground from this ceiling. I don't know. I skipped over everything. That kind of sucks. Grab all those. Grab all those. Now play defense. Play defense. Play defense. Play defense. Come on. Oh, I'm playing some offense still. I've got a lot of rings there. I got 18 more that time. I don't usually get that much many more. I actually nailed that that time. Oh, you want more things in the trash? Huh? What is that? We found this in the trash bin next to the printer. Um, it's a band. Uh, it's a band tickets website. Tails don't. Yes. Ah, is that how money? Um, Hot Honey's website. No way. I love them. Uh, Hot Honey. It's the band I'm currently obsessed with. Jeremy B. Uh, it is. Huh. My current favorite. Um, all the members have B after the name. Yes, he he isn't cute. I haven't gone to any of the shows yet to see them though. The tickets are really hard to get. You must be really online at a specific time to sell in minutes. So the question becomes, why was the paper found in the train car station? Shadow station. Watch yourself, Fox. The situation is becoming much clearer. I don't know how. Tails figured this out so soon, but I see where he's heading. The printout of Hot Honey's band ticket website exists because Shadow's buying the tickets. Uh, Shadow's a big Hot Honey, you know. Shadow's buying it for Amy. What? What? Shadow, is this true? Are you trying to get these concert tickets for my birthday? I've done a poor job hiding the surprise, it seems. Yes, I'm trying to get the concert tickets for your birthday. Sh Shadow, I used to print it earlier and I found it difficult to manage. When I was logging into the website, did you print the homepage by accident? How the? Yes, that's exactly what happened. I'm not fantastic with computers, admittedly. I can't believe this. After I accused you of murder, spill everything, Shadow. The cat's out of the bag. I want to know everything. Fine. Surprise ruined anyway. Oof, probably our fault here. Ah, sorry. That's all detective jobs, I suppose. Hmm. When I arrived on the tr tr train, I realized everyone else had a gift for me. Worried about for my social status, I immediately began brainstorming ideas. And when I saw the computer, remember Amy had never seen any hot honey land alive, and I looked it up. That's when I actually printed out the homepage. The concert tickets weren't actually on sale, I realized, but would be available soon. Is that the appointment you keep speaking of? At the time you were able to actually buy the concert tickets? Precisely. I haven't purchased the tickets yet. I knew how to keep Amy away while I waited for the buy the pick tickets, so I began locking the doors. But for the safety of everyone, I handed out keys so they could get out, get in and out, telling them not to let anyone through. It didn't work. Amy still managed to make it here somehow. It's because the conductor gave me this. The master key. The key opens up any door on the train. I've gotten through every locked door with ease. The plan's fatal fall. The birthday key. I should have guessed. Well, it's a well-known privilege. Shadow, I, your gesture is so sweet. And after I accused you too, how about this? Let me buy the tickets later and make it up to you. And you can come with me. Um, I don't know if too late it's happening. E can't wait. Show of the lifetime. So, fine. Happy birthday, Amy. I expect lots of pictures in the concerts you took. Hmm. Seems the mystery of Shadow's locked doors finally reached the end. I blame my source for all this. That wasn't the hot tip at all. Leading me to Shadow was be uh, behind everything. My credibility as a journalist reporter down the drain. Amy, I am curious. Who is the source? Is your biggest scoop? I'd like to know as well. Sorry, strictly confidential. My credibility may be shot, but my principles must stay intact. I have a strong feeling I know exactly who your source is. But we need to investigate one last area of the conductor's car. I'll come with you. I'd like to know who's been dragging my name through the mud. And I'll join as well. Time to see what, uh, this through the end. We're more than happy to have you both. Zirak, I hate to say it, but I believe our investigation is finally coming to a close. Pieces are coming together. The full pictures are coming clear and clear. Let's end this, Tails. We'll pin that Sonic's murder for good. Right on, then. Let's do it. And we're going to go ahead and do that in the next video, I think. I think that was a wonderful time to go ahead and stop that. And we are going to go ahead and end this game. Probably
probably in the next video. I'll probably just try to finish off the game how, however long it ends up being um, in the next video and stuff like that. I love this game. I really enjoy it. I'll talk about it more at the end and stuff like that. But this has been awesome. I really, really enjoy this. Other than that, though, I'd just say thank you guys so much for watching this video. Make sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, and subscribe if you enjoy this. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you guys next time. Goodbye.